Hey guys, one more time before we end today. We have got the puppy of the day for you and you've already met her. Her name is Addie. She's right back there and she's getting ready to be introduced to you guys. But she's beautiful. Now let me tell you some details about her. Addie is an F one B medium teddy bear golden doodle from the Adeline litter. And I am telling you, she is a classic English golden doodle puppy. And as you can see, she's a big old baby. She's pink stripe girl and she's with Angie now and she is holding her just like a big baby. A gorgeous mm -hmm. puppy. So I just wanted to let you see her and see what kind of sweet baby she is. We're going to get her on the ground in just a few minutes, but I want to flip this around. There you go, Angie. So look at this sweet girl. I am telling you, she's an F1B. She's going to be on that bigger side. She's going to be not like 35 pounds. Our mediums are like 35 to like 50 pounds. She's going to be in that 45, 48 pounds. And look how, how she just cuddles and snuggles. Isn't she pretty? Turn her face around so they can see her beautiful face. Oh, my gosh. Look at that baby. Look at that head. That is the classic classic English teddy bear. Now, our golden doodles are not the typical golden doodles that you just see everywhere. A lot of people want to know why are your puppies so beautiful and sometimes so recognizable whenever they're on the streets or anywhere. It's because ours are English golden doodles. This is like the premium golden doodle out there. These are the the golden doodles are all um, developed from our English golden retrievers that have been imported from Europe. And so they're not even like American golden retrievers. The American golden retriever is gold, definitely. That's in their name. They are a little bit leaner, a little bit more sporty. They're more gun dogs, but the European ones are not. The European golden retrievers are more confirmational. They're not as more as much sporty. They're big blockier heads. They're shorter in statue, but broader in chest and broader in head. And as you can see, this girl, even though she's a medium F1B, she has got the biggest blockiest head. And this puppy was born in June. She's still just a puppy and she's just going to get more beautiful by the day. So I wanted y'all to see her just hanging out in Angie's arms. I know she's a handful. Are you okay, Angie? Oh, yeah. Okay. But just look at that beautiful face as she's curious and checking everything out and, and just look at the black pigmentation. You're so pretty. The black pigmentation in her eyes and her nose and her paw pad. That's so classic of the English golden doodle. So I want y'all to understand the difference because an English golden retriever cannot even show in the United States because they would be um, they would be disqualified or points taken off because of how cream and light they are because that's not truly um, you know confirmationally sound for a, a golden retriever in the states. So whenever I was showing my goldens, they had to actually go and show in Europe and all around the European cities. But look at that beauty. Isn't she great? I absolutely love, mm -hmm. love that baby girl. Look. Hi, look at the baby girl. Angie, she's just doing so good. I know you got an armful, but I just love how she's just hanging out. Are y'all just loving her? What are y'all thinking? Hey, Jackie and Sandra and Linda. Good to see y'all. Good to see you. Isn't she pretty? If you've ever seen our English Goldens, they are amazing. Blow away. Amazing. And uh, they make the most beautiful golden retrievers. Hey, Linda. Good to see you. Hey, how are you holding down in this weather? It's yucky here today. Let's walk over by the window, Angie. So today... We are having a little tropical depression coming in, and uh, so they can really see her in the light, how beautiful she is. But outside, it's raining, but inside, it's beautiful because we're got, we got beautiful babies. So if you are looking for a gorgeous, big, clunky, now I'm not going to say giant big like 
a large golden retriever. These are going to be smaller because they're downsized. They're mediums. But uh, but still, they're going to have a lot of bone and a lot of substance. Look at her little face. Yeah, they got a lot of bone. Look at that paw. A lot of bone, a lot of substance to her. She's got a great coat. She's got an allergy-friendly, low-to-non-shedding coat. So... Um, She's just a sweetheart. The other day, I think first of the week, her brother was going live and me and going home and me and Angie ran in here and I was like, guys, I've got to go live with this beautiful puppy going home. And I said, there is a girl and I want y'all to meet her. I know she does, Sandra, have pretty eyes and a, and a cute button nose. Isn't she cute? I show that pretty face of yours. Show that pretty face. Look at that black nose. That photographs so well. If you all want a puppy that's real classy and flashy and photographs well, the ones like this with the big black nose, the black eyes, and then the, Somatic. yeah, it's very beautiful. A lot of the Insta-famous dogs have this pigmentation and they have this look, but it just photographs. So talk about a bear, just a cuddly mm -hmm. she's bear. Like she's loving this. She wants to go to sleep. Let's go sit in the chair, Angie. Okay. Let's go. So whenever you get adopted here at Samaralia, you come to the chapel barn if you, if you pick up and you get to sit in this big, beautiful chair and uh, you get a picture with your happy gotcha day picture. And so all of our clients get to sit here in this beautiful chair and get their photograph. Look at her. She's posing. Hi, baby. Nice. Look at you. She's ready for her She pictures. is. And I'm going to show her. Look, we got these cute toys in. They look like little doodles. And so they're so cute. Let's see if they got good squeakers. Look. Look. What do you think? Look at that. Look. You like it? It's the cutest doodle toy. And I love it. And it's new in our boutique. Look at this little toy, baby. Oh, I'm going to drop it on the ground. <gasps> See that cute little puppy? Isn't it cute? Y'all see how she just hangs with Angie? Now, she's got moderate um, energy. I mean, she's got good energy. She's not a she super lazy not puppy. Right, but when I put her down and I tell Angie, take off, let's play, she's going to get up and she's going to move around. And she's, oh, she's so funny. But she's got a soft mouth to her. You see how she's gently, mm -hmm. you know, just licking she's Angie? Very no. She's very gentle. Isn't she cute, y'all? Gorgeous. I love her ears too. Sue, she's got beautiful ears. Hey, baby. Look at that sweet girl hanging out. Yeah, show us, show us a pretty face. What you doing? What you doing? You want to bark? Just a bark at me. She doesn't talk to her. She won't bark. Come on. Just bark. Come on. <laughs> you want to get down, pretty girl? Yeah, let's get her down and let her just play. All right, now you can see her move a little oh, bit. Oh, she said, I'm getting that toy running. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah. She's like, give me that doodle toy. Hey, puppy of the day gets to pick her toy. That's right. That's your, that's your toy now. This is all yours. Here, Isn't she pretty? She's just a special puppy, and I wanted y'all to see her. I mean, I love this age of puppy. You know, everybody has their favorite baby stage, like... With babies, infants, like my little mm -hmm. Evie today came and stayed at the farm, and my granddaughter, and she's 18 months, and so she's about the age that these puppies are. Mm -hmm. I like that four-month-old age puppy because they're not so tiny and fragile, and you got to worry about exposing them to everything, but they're still big old chunky babies, and I just love mm -hmm. that. She loves the doodle naughty toy. It's it's a hit. You like it? I yes. knew you would. I knew you would love it. That's why yes. we got the cute toys like that. <laughs> That's why we got them. And we said you could have a toy. That's right. We said you could. 
Isn't she great? She's just a great puppy. I love this size. She's already oh, fully she vetted. So we've already put, you know, like puppies have to have six week vaccines, nine, 12, 15. You know, they have to have all those. Well, she's vetted. We've, we've been doing that. We've been maintaining her. She's um, been, you know, in up at the puppy cottage. So she has a great schedule. She's getting socialized and playing now. She's at the perfect age to start learning. If you are wanting to send a dog to Doodle Prep School to be maybe a pet partner or a companion dog or just a great family pet, it's such a great time to send a puppy to school and to start their training because they're ready to get out and about. And she's sweet. Love she's that. Well, she's got a good temperament. She's mm -hmm. got a super good temperament. So, guys, if you're interested in a puppy like this, and this is your dream puppy, this classic English teddy bear golden doodle, give us a call at Smarai at 251-960-1311. You can go to teddybeargoldendoodles.com. Look at our gorgeous puppies and uh, go ahead and get online if you're even wanting to get a puppy in the spring or you're wanting to get a puppy in the, especially during the holidays you need to go ahead and submit your puppy application right now because right now is the time if you want a puppy trained to get them enrolled in school there's only like what 10 weeks left till Christmas so anyways you guys have a great weekend. We are going to stay out of the rain, and we are going to keep this place dry and keep our puppies in. And uh, we love y'all. Thank you for following us. And if you got any questions, give us a call. We're here to 5 Central Time, okay? Bye. Bye.